Hello right, guys, my name is Kane from Blue Dragon Distro, and today we're going to be doing an unboxing and a review of the AMVR head strap, which will be this guy right here. So stay tuned. All right, guys, so let's open this up. I can get open. All right. Sorry if I hit the, the lens. So here we go. We got two head pads uh, for the Oculus Quest uh, 2. And this is these are both from AMVR, like I said before. So we got, um, you can see here, we got one black, one white. So let's open up. They're both going to be the same. I'll show you, but let's open up this black one. No, I don't have any tools on me. There we go. I see it will get open. Let me show you what comes into this one, at least. All right. So this is the head pad here. Sorry, I keep on the screen. So this is what you get. I actually like this. This actually looks nice. This with the style that they used here actually gives it more of that kind of futuristic look. Like it's starting to remind me, well, not going to go into that. It reminds me of a movie, but anyway. And then there's the AMVR logo right there. And does anything else come? Yep. We got our usual instructions and warranty stick, warranty card. So we got a warranty card there. And how to install it. Well, it should be straightforward. At least I hope it is. All right. And that's not bad. So you just got to take this off. Okay. Got to take off the mold. And just for the hell of it, you know, it should be the same exact thing. Sorry, guys. I really didn't bring any tools to do this at the moment. And like I said, I don't have the camera person, so it's only me. So here we go. This is the other head pad. <clears throat> and this is the white one. Also looks nice. I prefer black, but white isn't bad. Mm -hmm. So that's those two. And it should be all the same thing. So you have your instructions. And you have the warranty card. All right, so I'm going to be doing the black one. So we'll just go into the installation. All right, guys, so let's do the installation. So first we got to remove the facial interface. So I hate how it pops out sometimes. Oh, by the way, there was a, a review I did for the EMVR facial interface that you may want to check out. So I'll leave that with um, a card up here that you can click on. All right, let me take this off. And then this part of the strap goes through here. You gotta make sure it comes out on the same side. If anything, that was the hard part. Maybe. <laughs> All right, let's get this guy back on. There we go. At least that's it for that part. We'll leave the face one to face off for now. All right. Now you just gotta come back here. 
lift this guy up like this. Put this down more. Then we get these two clips in. Install, but I have two more slots. I don't know. <laughs> there we go. Now that my head will fit in this, I will have to adjust all this. I haven't been using this for a while. <laughs> but at least it's in there. I can just give it a light tug on both ends. I don't have this even. See, that's the thing. I'm not too fond on the Oculus strap. I don't like the Oculus strap, actually. So, but with that note, if you don't want to buy the Elite strap, you got this guy, which will cup the back of your head the same way. And just to complete it, let's put this guy back on. set so already and i will show you how it looks on the head Right, guys now we're down to the review so uh, as you can see it wasn't hard to install um you saw a quick you know me actually wearing the headset and everything so um i was playing the the climb with this for for a little bit and when i was playing the game the climb it honestly uh the strap the mvr strap did not feel like it was gonna slide off anytime and that was one of my concerns because when i used the strap that came with the headset uh, that I got in the beginning, it felt like that was gonna slide off and everything because I feel like, you know, this is head heavy. So it just feels like it was gonna slide off and fall off. So, you know, honestly, if you're looking at getting the Elite Strap, so this guy here, this guy here, but this one has the battery. I'm sorry, I don't have a table in front of me. So this guy here, if you're looking at getting one of these was just more money. You know, I would definitely say get the AMVR head strap first and give it a shot. And the reason why I say that, because, you know, if you're watching this video looking for an alternative, you know, a lot of people have said that these has uh, break and other stuff, even though they gave extended warranty. Um, so if you're shopping around for an elite strap because you feel like um, that the Oculus Quest 2 is a little head um, heavy on, on the front and you're worried that it may slip, then honestly i would say give this a shot buy buy the amvr head strap cheaper um to purchase is not the quality of it is not you know it's not like it's gonna break on you and this is not like you know delicate so it's not going to fall apart on you in any way um and like i said it does actually hold on the back of the head so it doesn't feel like it's going to slip off um you know, so it wouldn't hurt to give this a shot. It's not that expensive. I'll put the price here in the corner if I never mentioned the price. Um, and yeah, I, I would definitely say it wouldn't hurt to give it a try. So me personally, I would recommend this. Um, definitely if you're not looking to spend the money on an Elite Strap. So I would definitely recommend on uh, purchasing this. Um, and that's it. So uh, please, you know, if you like the video, leave a like. Um, 
If you haven't subscribed and you came across this video, please subscribe. Uh, we are planning on making more videos um, dealing with VR, Oculus Quest, and we do do random technology um, stuff. So definitely uh, check us out. Have a good one and take care.